Hey, hey, what's going on everybody? This is Daxton here with Noxide.org. I just made a video a second ago, but I like to keep uh, the topics of my videos separate, but I am still working on this website, Immigration Agency Reviews, uh, excuse me, .com. And uh, so basically in this one, we're going to be, let me tell you kind of what's going to happen. People will be able to go here, click post your own review. They'll be able to fill this out, submit it, and it'll basically create a post without a user being logged in or anything. It's basically just a guest post feature. Um, this plugin is called Front and let me look just to make sure I don't want to tell you wrong. Um, user Front End, I think WP User Front End, and there's also a pro version, you should check it out. Uh, it's pretty simple uh, to use overall. But basically what I was getting at is when you're, when these posts are made, I want to be able to declare on the website which page or what posts show up on what page. In this case with like the latest reviews page, you can see there's nothing there, nothing's been posted yet, but we'll test it out in a second. Um, but I want the latest post, no matter what country they're posted from or what they're about, things like that, I want all of the latest posts that guest users post to show up on this page. Now assuming, hopefully this is, um, what you're trying to do since you're on this video hopefully um, this will help you out but it's actually pretty simple we're going to use a plugin good thing about WordPress is there's a plugin for almost everything sometimes it's just a problem with finding the right program um, but in this case we're going to be using uh, I believe it's called uh, display post short code I have the zip file here for it I'll also uploaded on my website You'll be able to do a search for it there as soon as this video is up. Um, you know, I like to upload things like that to my website um, just so I can find it easier later. I know it's the, the plugin I use, and I know it's good, I know it's a stable version. And maybe later on, you know, that plugin, if it gets updated um, and it doesn't work anymore, or uh, they just stop updating it when it doesn't work or for some reason it gets removed you know that way I always have this plugin on my website for you to be able to download it for myself to be able to download you know for future use um, but definitely if there's a newer version out go ahead and download it um, I'm assuming you know how to add a plugin just be able to download it or you can you can go to add new basically and search for the plugin or you can upload it if you have the zip file and let's see where's it at here it's called the display posts short code is what it is so basically you'll be able to post a or place a short code um, on any page of your website and it's going to show the specific posts that you want that page to show in this case I want it to show all of the posts that are submitted so we'll go to the latest reviews page this is where I want it and here's the short code, and you can edit this however you choose, but this is the short code that I added. Basically, it's displaying, po displaying posts. Now, I could close it off right there. Let me show you. Um, oops. I'd be able to do this and close it off. And this right here would simply display all the posts, okay? Just basic. Nothing more, nothing less, okay? Um, but in this case, I want it to include the excerpt, which is a little bit of text, and I want it to show um, 30 characters, which is like 30 letters, 30 numbers, whatever, you know, whatever totals 30. Um, and then it'll kind of have you click read more, click the title to see more. But that's basically all you have to do, and you can, you can uh, definitely Google um, that plugin. And there's lots of variations you can use by just adding short pieces of code into the short code. And uh, if it's a correct short code, as long as you have it opened with that bracket, closed with the bracket, have correct stuff in it, you know, update it, and it should work perfectly. So now I'm going to head on over to the website now that that's done, and I'm going to test this out. So I'll go post my own review. Uh, I'm not going to spend time and do this. Just type a few things here main complaint country I uh, have not added the countries yet um, there's a lot of countries in the world as you know I did just upload a video last night that shows you how you can add, uh, bulk add categories um, 
So like you don't have to go through and add each category one by one. That'd take hours, even days if you got tired of doing it. But this plugin I show you, you can add like every country in the world or you know, if you're just wanting to add a lot of categories in total, you know, you can just add them within seconds. It'll do it for you. Right now, I'll just click uncategorized because that really doesn't matter. I'm not there yet. And just type in whatever we want here. Blah, blah, blah. And you don't have to put contact info. That's only if someone wants it. And then we'll be able to click submit. It'll load. Okay, and it has been posted perfectly. Okay, now we can go to the latest reviews. And there we have it. It now shows main complaint. It has been posted. Um, but that's basically how you use that plugin. Uh, it's a good short code um, plugin to be able to show posts, whatever posts you want on whatever page, and then be able to simply click on it read more about it that's the review you know so on title the category which in this case it'll be countries and then the date it was posted anyway that's it for this video guys please like share subscribe comment if you have any questions or suggestions um, you know you can uh, uh, check out my website www.noxad.org n-o-x-a-d.org link will be in the description here on youtube if you're on youtube right now uh, but that's it, and I'll see you guys later. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.